Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This is the Dungeon Dice Dimension. I'm Dice Master Killer Mike. And I'm Dice Master Samurai Snoop. And we are back with game number 16 of the season. Hopefully it's a barn burner. That's right. Hopefully we get some new interesting monsters that we haven't seen yet. And you did a you did a fabulous job last game of uh you know shutting down Blast Lizard. Yeah. Well, I mean, it helps when you summon a bunch of level four monsters in a game. Usually you only see like one, and what did I summon, like three? Right. He he was busting out those level fours like he's been playing <laughs> Dungeon Dice Monsters for years. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. All right, there's your hit point dice. Thank you. Number six. Dark Magician. You'll start us off. That's right, and let's see what I got in my hand here. Well, I'll be. All right. Well, this will be an interesting game. All right, I'm going to start off with a level two summon attempt. And I will get two magic crests. And a level 2 summon with 2 attack crests. Okay, and we are going to do the L summon. Indeed. Because if you don't do it, you lose 100% <laughs> of the time. And it's going to be the Crawling Dragon. Crawling Dragon. And there's the card. Nice. Alright, you may go. I shall start off. Well, level three summon. Ooh. And I shall get him plus wow. one. Whoops. Sorry about that. One attack crest and one attack, two movements. That's not a bad roll. No, that was pretty good crest counts and uh, you got the summon. Oh, uh, and I shall summon. Surprise, surprise. This has been a classic move for me. Yes. Curse of Dragon. <clears throat> the old Curse of Dragon. Also in the L shape. Naturally. Your move. All right. Well. Hmm. All right. That's going to be my plan. I'm going to go for a level one summon here. We can up summon to level two. Hmm. Um. No. I'm not going to. I'm going to summon the Carbonella Warrior. Nice. And also roll for the other crests. That's a nice roll right there. Ooh, four defense. That is always nice, considering yep. not, what, only two dice types have defense crests on them? Yep. Uh, level ones, and, and fours. level fours, yep. Yeah. All right, you may go. I will summon, well, attempt a level two. I can up summon. Up summon to three. I will Why? keep my level two summon. And two movements. Nice. Two magic crests. And I shall summon. Giant Soldier of Stone. Mm. Very defensive. I play him face monsters. down. That's right. In defense mode. Great. Okay, you're finished? Yeah. I'm going for the level four. Oh, God. Let's see how it is today. Hot hand in a dice game. That's right. <laughs> Clickety clack. Let's go. No, no level four summon, but we did get some crests that are uh, much needed. Nice to have. Let me just double check here. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I'm going to use the uh, the Crawling Dragon's ability to put a Shell Ground token for four Magic Crests. There you go. And I'm going to put it right there. Let's just get these on the squares. Yes, right there. Okay, perfect. And that is the end of my turn. Hmm. 
Level two summon. Two movements, two attacks, and one magic crest. Very nice. Level two. I shall succeed. Nice. Who am I dealing with now? I shall summon and Tetsu. Ah, I see, I see. What a thorn in the side that Ensetsu is. How do I want to build? Where are you? There he is. Right there. He's hiding out. He's coming forward. All right, and you're done? I am done. Okay, let's go for a level four summon here. Ooh. I saw the one level four star. I was excited. Okay, we got four movements. Well, I didn't get a summon, so you can go ahead. Use... Yes, the level ones, I think. No, level twos again. All right. Level, and I can summon. Another level two, eh? And a magic crest. And two attacks. Hmm. I summon the Dark Magician Girl. Oh, geez. Okay. Magic Crest Creator. I will spend two Magic Crest... Uh, no, I won't. Your turn. Okay. Well... There she is. I'm going to go for the level four again. Come on, level four. That's a lot of movement. And one defense. Oh, oh my, my god. god. Let's go. All right. Well, I'm summoning the Black Luster Soldier. We are going to go straight into the offense with this. Build it right there. And I will move the Blackluster Soldier one, two, three spaces and attack and Setsu. He's, he's yours, not mine. No, remember he kills him oh, so yeah, we're. Yeah, yeah, I like that. He goes like on that. your monster so we can keep keep stack. Keep, keep, track. keep track of stats here. Okay. Uh, so, yes, that is the end of my turn. Blackluster has one kill. Level three, two traps, four traps, my bad, and an attack. Two movements and two trap crests. Your move. Okay, well, I mean, let's go for more level fours. Movements, attack, and defense. So I guess I kind of need attack crests at this point. Uh, two more movements, one trap, and nothing. I will move one, two, three, four spaces and attack the giant soldier of stone. What's your attack? 50, right? It is 50 altogether, yes. Ooh, that kills him. I don't have a defense crest anyway. Okay. You may go. Traps, one movement, and an attack. Two more movements. Caps me out. One attack. Your move. 
I am now realizing that the Blackluster Soldier cannot attack the Cursed Dragon. Nope. This poses an issue. Uh, two magic crests, one attack crest. Huh. A level well, five monster. <laughs> a level five monster. The beaver warrior. Jeez. <laughs> okay. Um, well. Let's go ahead and summon something. <coughs> Let's summon the blue eyes white dragon. Because why not? Okay, I end my turn. Two traps, caps me out, two movements, already capped. Two traps, capped. I'm capped on everything. Your turn. Okay. Hmm. Well. Let's see here. Where do I want to go for? Let's go for a level. Hmm. Let's go for level four, I guess. I got many. Oh my god! Good lord. We were joking earlier before the game started about just giving me an all level four hand, and uh, that could be very dangerous because apparently I just summon level fours quite easily. Okay. Well, let's throw out the uh, Dark Magician here. Dark Magician and Blue Eyes working on the same team. Yeah. Okay, let's see. What can I do? Hmm. I'm going to pass my turn. You can go ahead. I'm going to go with the level 1s. Two defense crests. Get the level 1 and summon. And the level 1 summon. That's an item. One movement crest, but I'm capped. That's my play. Whoops, there's your piece. Okay. Hmm. Oh, that's my piece. Yeah, yeah. Sorry about that. Oh, good. Okay, let's see here. What to do, what to do. Let's go for a level three summon. Get a movement, one attack. And two movements and one attack. Okay, ba -ba -ba -ba. let's see. Let's go ahead and I'm gonna move the Black Luster Soldier three spaces up. And that is my turn. <coughs> Pardon me. Oh, 
I'm going to go up to level four. Two movements, two magics. Two de one defense crest. I thought that trap crest was a level four. I was like, oh. Your turn. All right. Level three summon attempt. Two traps, one movement. And level three summon. And we are going to summon the Thunderball. Nice. Okay. And I will move the Thunderball two spaces. One, two, use his ability for three magics. And then I will move the Black Lesser Soldier three spaces and attack the Monster Lord. And you can go. Capped out on all those. I need this level three summon in a bad way. You got it. Magical dragon. Oy. <laughs> it's not where I wanted to use him, but. Oh, I'm sure it would have been a nice when they were clumped together. <laughs> That's what I was trying to do. I kind of figured when you like were, you know, trying to figure out the piece placement. Well, also, when I I was trying to pick the power disc up. Oh, I shouldn't have said it's the power disc, but I was trying to get the, the item with the Curse of Dragon. Oh, okay, okay. So I could fight, you know, Blue Eyes. Curse of Dragon versus Blue Oops. Eyes, and he has a chance. Where are you, Magical Dragon? So I will move him... One, two, three, four, five. I wonder if I can get Dark Magician in this blast. That's what I'm trying to see. Um, no, because I think here doesn't hit Black Luster, and then here doesn't hit Dark Magician. So I don't think there's a way. <laughs> Getting greedy. Right? Yeah, so right here, one, two, three four squares and three magic crests and boom goes the dynamite okay well magical dragon I see how it is well let's go ahead and try to summon a level three monster get one attack one movement no two movements just need one attack and four traps but i can only get two more okay well hmm i better move one two three One, okay, one, two, three. So I should be okay with, uh, don't have to move anybody yet. Right? Here. Yeah. I don't think there's a way you can get both of them, so I will end my turn. I will use a level four, the level four dice. Okay. Two magic crests. That's what I need. Two movements and one defense crest. Two movements, two magics. And one trap, which I'm capped. <clears throat> I 
which I will move one, two, three, four squares. And blow the dark magician up. Blow the dark magician up. Okay. Well. Your turn. Let's go with level three again. We got two movements. And a level four if I want it. Ugh. So tempting, but uh, maybe, maybe it's worth it. Um, thirty defense. Thirty. No, I will go for the level three summon, and it is going to be the Buster Blader. Beautiful. Yes. And we are going to put the Buster Blader right in here. And one, two, three, four, five. I have five movement crests. I'm just going to go right for your Monster Lord, make an attack, and end my turn. Okay. Damn. That puts the pressure on, don't it? Yeah. And what do you got? 30 HP? Uh, 30 HP, 10 defense. 10 defense. I think I have one way to kill this guy, but I need... Oh my god. I need movements and a summon. All right. <laughs> the pressure's on. Yeah. Movements and a summon. Here we go. So level two summon, got him. Thirteenth grave. Oh, interesting. Okay. Right there. Okay. What do I need? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So I need three movements. All right, so two of them have to be the double movement crest. <laughs> yeah. The heart of the dice. Let's see. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Yeah, that seems about right. Yeah, because I would need I need three to move here, and then four to move here. Yep. Okay. Oh, I thought you got it. I, st I only saw this one. I was like, oh my god. Yeah, damn. I think that's the game. So basically, I spend two trap crests to convert... Four trap crests to convert them into two magic crests. Use those two magic crests to kill 13th grave to do 10, 10 damage. damage. Buster later. What do you got for defense crest? Oh no! What do you got? I'm maxed, oh, I was I yeah. was looking down. I was like, oh <laughs> yeah, I maxed almost maxed out on defense. Crest. I was like, <laughs> if I had none, you had it. Yeah. Move three. Make an attack. Use a defense crest and take ten more damage. And then yeah, move three and then come up one short. Yeah. Very close. And obviously your monster sword can attack too. Yeah. I defend that. You defend that. And then your turn. Get the defense crest back. And who six movement crest. And then I finish off the monster lord with the Buster Blader. Good job. Damn, that was a back and forth battle. You were like, you pushed up. I was like, oh god, I, I'm like, like I only had level fours and level ones basically. I mean, Buster Blader and Thunderball were my aces in the hole. 
And uh, I was able to summon those level fours, which I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I can't explain that. I'm just lucky, I guess. And then you were able to destroy them with the magical dragon. I was worried as soon as I saw you kind of like placing pieces here. I'm like, oh, my monsters are clumped. You're going to blow them all up. I'm sure you have the magic dragon. And then, yeah, Buster Blader was kind of the... Because he can't be affected by the magic no, dragons. No, absolutely. Which effect. forced me to retreat, actually. Where... I don't know. I actually didn't even consider that you would be able to kill my Buster Blader when I rushed him up. I was like, yeah. there's no way. He's going to have to summon something. I was looking. I'm like 20 and 20. I'm like, you can only block 10 of each. And then the 13th grave. But I needed one more. I needed this. So the 13th grave... Uh, its role screwed me because it was yes because if it would have been a movement with that then you're you're fine or if let's take a look at yoranzo does yoranzo have 20 attack if dark magician girl was yoranzo no no i don't think so yeah you were pretty like and, and if you kill uh buster blader like i'm pretty sure you would win why I was, is this going to get blasted by him? There's no way I can move to kill there's him. There's no way you could have killed him. No. No, there was absolutely I, no I way. just steal your defense. Karakasaurus, because I did have him, mm. is the only way. Gotcha. Uh, even that takes two attacks, because 60 attack is all I get. If he's still alive, you get 30 defense. Yeah. So, yeah, it was... Because that's what I was going to do, because I could up-summon, right? Yeah. I was like, do I summon him and kill him no i can't no, you would him. have lost him exactly so it was, i would have uh, never moved dark magician girl in and you would have lost him yeah so yeah it was up to that if buster blader dies but i've lost it would have just been a longer game because i then i would have had to have figured you would have summoned busted blader eventually yeah Eric Rock. yeah exactly i would have but yeah no it was it was close like i said like one space away if you kill the buster blader there i'm out i've lost so. Yeah, needed one movement. I can understand why people in the past were frustrated with this game. Yes. There's just literally like counters to certain monsters like plays. You know, and if it's like if Curse of Dragon was still there, it could be another stalemate because of Buster Blader's ability. For sure. So and I was worried about that again. It might have it might have well been if uh you know Thunderball didn't do his didn't do his thing. Yeah. We gotta give it up to today's game MVP, the Buster Blader, my personal favorite dungeon dice monster. Yeah, I mean Buster Blader was honestly the only one that could have won me the game in this because Magical Dragon was a force to be reckoned with. I had nothing to deal with him. Uh, blue eyes, maybe, but I didn't have enough movement press to even get close. He would have died immediately. Buster Blade is immune to any dragon type Especially creature's effects. With Dark Magician Girl on the field being able to create magic crests, it was just a matter of time before Blue Eyes met its fate. Not to mention, Magical Dragon. Can, can steal the defense of a monster inside the dungeon so exactly it makes him just a tank a explosive beast he can kill anything except for the buster yep. blader who was the only one that could have harmed him yep and not to mention buster blader finished off the monster lord yes with so. two attacks so great job buster blader yeah there you guys go game number 16 hope you enjoyed it this has been another episode of the dungeon dice dimension I'm Dice Master Killer Mike. And I'm Dice Master Samurai Snoop. And we'll catch you in the next one.